would violate your constitution, potentially use physical violence to end democracy is a, is a tyrant, is a dictator. Tucker Carlson is in Spain right now, out there protesting with the people trying to save their country. Check this out. Anybody who would violate your constitution, potentially use physical violence to end democracy is a, is a tyrant, is a dictator. And this is happening in the middle of Europe. So uh, we thought it deserved more coverage than it's getting. Oh. <laughs> if your government is allowing foreigners to come in and hurt you, they're committing war against you. You know, our news media doesn't report a lot of things. And in our time here, it's very obvious that the socialists in an alliance with the separatists are trying to end the rule of law in Spain. If you don't have freedom of speech, you don't have the freedom to defend yourself, and you can't vote your way out of it, the system is rigged, and you're in real trouble, real trouble. So I, I'm really rooting for your success. Is the world actually seeing how um, important is what is happening here? No, no, the world is not seeing how important it is. Um, but we hope to change that. Yeah, I'm sure you will. Thank you very much. Thank you. We hope to change that indeed, and Tucker Carlson is doing the right thing. Again, I, I'm not an expert in every little bit of what is happening on the ground there, uh, but does the idea of the elites flooding your country with people who shouldn't be there and throwing signs of socialism and stamping down on dissent and all of that kind of stuff, that sound like maybe it's kind of a little bit of what's going on here too, so you might want to care what's happening in Spain, right? That's why these things, you don't have to care about the Jews particularly, but you might wanna care about what's happening to Israel, a Western democracy in a place where it, there isn't a lot of that. You may not care about the Spanish people specifically, or you might not care about Western Europe, but you might go, oh, there's something happening there that could kinda happen here. And of course, because of the internet and because of phones, our connectivity and the ability for these riots whether they're riots to tear down societies or whether they're protests to uphold the goodness of society, they can spread like wildfire. So this is what's happening in America right now. We have a political party, and, and by the way, the Republicans kind of suck too, right? But we have a political party, the Democrats, that are trying to flood America with non-Westerners who will vote for Democrats. And then eventually they will have the House, they will have the Senate, they will have the White House, and what will they do? But you know what? It's not just them because yes, I often say, I am a Florida Republican very proudly. First time I ever registered as a Republican here in Florida. But the National Republican Project, I don't know what to make of it. I really do not know what to make of it.